especially the unexpected ones. In the summer of 2006, I received multiple gifts. I got my master's degree in applied psychology. My fiance proposed to me. Life was perfect. But exactly one week after that proposal, my fiance was killed in a motorcycle accident. This wasn't a gift. This was grief. This was hard and sad. Contrary to what I'd known a gift to be. But what I came to realize is that this was my unexpected gift. One that I had to carefully unwrap. And within it, I found the ability to uplift others anchored in their grief. Now, let me say that grief isn't just associated with death. Grief can be any significant loss, like that of an end of a relationship, or even a job loss. This led me to write a book, and eventually inspired me to host retreats, letting people know that grief is indeed a gift. Hi, my name is Angela Grant, founder and CEO of Angela's Anchor. I help people know when to lift their anchor by providing grief-related wellness through retreats to support them on their journey. I've had over 20 years of experience and it's a privilege of helping thousands of individuals navigate grief and loss. Did you know that unresolved grief affects 23 million of the U.S. population? with women aged 25 to 65 being disproportionately impacted. Well, at Angela's Anchor, I, we offer a supportive environment for those women to transform that grief into strength and growth. A recent Condé Nast article states that grief-related wellness is a top wellness travel trend of 2024. So we're on trend. <laughs> We've hosted two retreats this year, and we will be hosting and we will be hosting 10 to 12 women quarterly in the coming year. So now close your eyes and imagine a picturesque property surrounded by nature's beauty on a farm here in Nashville, Tennessee, where I actually grew up. Yes, I grew up on a farm with horses and ponies. <laughs> you will be welcome to share your honest emotions and experiences. You will build a community a team of curated experts and instructors will be there to support you and guide you through meditative nature walks, journaling, creative expression, candlelight vigils, and a host of other activities so that as you heal, you will be able to help others lift their anchor. And you will discover that your loss doesn't have to mean the loss of yourself. Lisa attended the Journey Towards Joy Retreat. She was dealing with some unresolved grief. You know that stuff I was talking about. She was dealing with it, but she came to the retreat and she was able to find unexpected joy at a grief retreat. Testimonies like hers is why I do what I do. It reassures me that I am on the right path and that Angela's anchor is truly making a difference. So now I'm asking for you to help me to continue to make that difference. I'm seeking a $200,000 investment to renovate the barn on our existing property, this barn where we grew up, me and my brother, he's in the audience, and he knows, it takes a lot of cleaning. But we, these funds will go towards much needed renovations, transform the space into a beacon of hope and healing. Grief isn't meant to make you sad. It's meant to make you present. I'm Angela Grant of Angela's Anchor encouraging you to lift your anchor and embrace the gift of grief.